guys, what's going on? Welcome to episode 8, man. The last, the final installment of this here Arnold Classic Australia 2015 vlog. And you guys are in for a treat, man, this here episode 8. I just on my way to, uh, to MJ HQ, bright and early in the morning, man. Got myself some decent sleep last night, actually, which was nice. So, got to bed by the time, by the time I actually got to bed, it was about, I think it was just before 2 a.m. So, uh, oh no, probably close to 1.30 to be honest. I don't know, I was that damn tired. My head hit the pillow and I was out like a light, man. But uh, but yeah, so let's say about 1.30, man. I was up this morning, up around 8. So I got myself some uh, over six hours sleep, which for me is fantastic, which is why I'm, I'm full of beans today. And I should be full of beans today because we've got eight time Mr. Olympia, the greatest bodybuilder of all time, Ronnie Coleman. Coming to Massey Joe's Flinders Park for a store visit today, man. And then we're doing a bunch of media with Ron. We've got interviews, we've got workout, we've got, man, all kinds of shit. And I'm, I, I, legit, of all the athletes that we work with, man, of all of the, the companies that we work with, I look the most forward to working with, with Ronnie Coleman. Those of you that follow us on YouTube, man, you know that we've done a bunch of media with Ronnie in the past. I was at Ronnie's house in Dallas with, uh, with Neve Vosh. Uh, after the Olympia last year, man, we just have we just have a blast whenever we do stuff with Ron. So I'm pumped, I'm excited. So anyway, I'm on my way to MJ HQ now. So it's just after. I did a little bit of work this morning on uh, at home, actually on on these on these vlogs. So working on these. So it's uh, it's actually just before 10 a.m. Um, so skip all my peak hour traffic and shit, which is nice. <laughs> and just on my way to MJ HQ, man. So MJ HQ, gonna bust out some more, some more work playing catch up as per usual this week, but it's all good. I'm gonna get onto that and then uh, head over to the store visit. So Ron's gonna drop in Master Joe's Flinders Park uh, between five, well, he's gonna start at five, it's supposed to be five to eight, um, but Ronnie tends to, to pull a big crowd, man. He's the type of guy that, he wants to, to, to take as long as it takes to get through every single person who comes out to see him. So we're going to start at five. Um, I'm not sure when we're going to finish, uh, but uh, I'll probably catch you guys. I might shoot some footage around MJHQ today, just show you guys what's going on. Um, but if not, we'll, uh, we'll we'll see you at the the before the beginning of the Ronnie Common store visit later on today. What's up guys? Okay, so on the way to go see uh, Big Ronnie Coleman at Massive Joe's Flinders Park. So it's just about to turn four o'clock, man. Ronnie's uh, supposed to roll up at the store at five. Just driving, well stopped in traffic now, I was just driving. Got my man Lenny sitting in the front seat. Mr. Uh, AKA Mr. Crowd Control. <laughs> <laughs> so Len's been helping us out with, uh, with the store appearances this week, man. So just on the way there, gonna get everything set up. Everything is, is pretty much set up. Just finish off setting up and uh, prepare for the arrival of Big Ron. And that's where we'll catch you guys next. All right, guys, so it's just gone past five, man. We're waiting on the big man himself, Ronnie Coleman, come visit us at Master Joe's Flinders Park. And the line, once again, for Big Ron is out the door. So come on with me, man. Let's go. We're gonna meet the people that have been waiting first in line to see Big Ron. Check this out. Come on in here. We got the VIP line happening up in here, man. People getting all their Ronnie Coleman signature series supplements, of course. The signing booth ready to go. The stool. We, we tried to get Ron a throne. We couldn't find one in uh, in short enough times. So the king's gonna have to sit on the stool. It's all good. And these guys, first guys in line. What's hey, your name, man? Uh, Jordan. Jordan. And we got Max. David. Max, Stuart. David, and Stuart, man. So you guys will be uh, first up to see Big Ryan. Yeah, Pretty Big exciting, Ryan. man. He's going to drop straight in here, sign whatever you want him to sign. Maybe you get him to sign your uh, school shirts. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, rock up school tomorrow. Good. Well, enjoy, guys. We'll have a good time meeting him. So that's it, man. We're going to uh, probably check in with you guys around halfway through the signing, see how everything's going. But uh, we'll just eagerly await the arrival of the greatest of all time, eight-time Mr. Olympia, Ryan Coleman at Massachusetts Park. Okay guys, sun's coming down. We're about an hour and a half into Ronnie Coleman's appearance. It's just gone half past six, man. He's been here since just after five. Back at Massachusetts Flinders Park, of course. And the line, still going. <laughs> Big Ron draws one hell of a crowd, man. There ain't no doubt. It was, uh, it was down there and behind that wall just a few minutes ago, so 
We're getting through them, we're getting through them slowly but surely. Big Ron spending time with everyone that's come out to see him, which is fantastic. Wouldn't expect anything less of him, of course. We've got some supplements going on here, man. A little bit of, a little, little bit, a little bit of Ronnie Coleman love going on. And then check it out in here, man. Big Ron's still doing his thing. Kissing babies, signing autographs. I don't, actually, I don't, think, I don't think there has been any babies kissed yet, but I think I did see one in the line out there. So I'm sure there might be. So Ron's just doing his thing, man. The VIP line is keeping nice and tight. So these guys up in here, man, are just, just about to, uh, to meet the big man himself. So we're gonna keep going. Judging by the number of people that's here, I mean, Ron was supposed to be here five to five to eight, I believe. Um, so we should be we should be done almost on time. Uh, the one thing that we did notice, and the fellas at the other stores have been saying, we'll be rocking up to the wrong store. So we may uh, we may be here a little bit later than eight, but we'll see what happens. And I already know Big Ron's told me, man, we're going to go uh, get ourselves some pre-workout Nando's before we go and train. So that's probably where we'll catch you guys at the uh, at our pre-workout meal. We're gonna keep grinding with Big Rock. <laughs> okay guys, so it's just gone just after 8 p.m. The store appearance is finished, the door is closed. Big Ron has meet, met and greet, or meted and greeted, for, for shocking language, um, everybody that's come to see him. And now it's, it's time for the, the business end of the evening. So everybody that was here that came and met Ron, that supported Ron by buying those Ronnie Coleman Signature Series products, you can see in the background right there, man, got themselves an entry uh, to come and train with us tonight. And all of those entries went in this vase, wrote their name and number down in the vase, and then Ronnie, right now, yeah, buddy. Is about to pick. Let's do it. Pick a name out of the uh, out of the hat. And let's see who it is. Let's see what we got this time. Yeah. Right. Andrew. Let's get some zoomer focus. That's Andrew right there. Yeah, Nobody buddy. go calling Andrew. We might have to blur that number out. <laughs> but we're gonna give Andrew a call right now. We're gonna train some legs. Let's hope that let's hope that he picks up the phone. Um, but Andrew, the lucky winner, man. So we're gonna uh, we're gonna give him a buzz. We're gonna head off to go get ourselves some food, man. Some some pre-workout meal. I think we're heading to Nando's, Ron. Yeah, buddy. We're gonna get some chicken and some rice and whatever else Ronnie feels like pre pre leg workout. Yes, sir. Yeah. And then we're gonna uh, we're he head on out to the gym after that, man. So uh, we will see you guys. Probably the next stop is gonna be our pre-workout meal at Nando's. What's up guys? So we're at Nando's getting ourselves pre-workout feed. I've got Lenny in the background. Who else is here, man? Alex. We got Asha. We got Jono. Oh, God, chicken. We got Josh. We got Noam. We got Derek. We got Scott. We got Ron. Yep. Who's that sitting behind Ron? I can't see. That's <laughs> one, mate. <laughs> <laughs> get away from my chicken. So we're getting ourselves, man, some uh, the perfect pre-leg workout meal, some chicken and rice. Real simple, man. What'd you guys, you yeah. guys beat us to it. What'd you think of the chicken and rice? It's delicious. Yeah? yeah. Get it done? Sponsor, hey, we get sponsored by Nando's. Right. Sponsorship from Nando's? We're getting paid for this video. Yeah. Yeah. You didn't even know it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna get this meal in and we'll, uh, we'll catch you guys at the yet to be disclosed location. We're gonna crush some quads tonight. Okay guys, so just rolling in here. Anytime fitness kill candy, just rolling on in. We got caught up at dinner, uh, having a bit of a chat about life and other things. <laughs> really just giving ourselves some time for some food to digest, man, because uh, you know we train our legs with a big dog tonight. So check it. Just so you guys know, you guys know I'm keeping it 100. Just about to go past 11 o'clock in the PM, man. About to go past 11, check this out. Anytime Fitness Kill Kenny is the secret location for this leg workout. I'm just gonna pan around a little bit. And I would go so far as to say, 11 o'clock at night, this many people in the gym, Somebody didn't keep a secret, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> anyway, Ron's on his way, man. As soon as he gets here, we're getting all warmed up over here. Getting some uh, some leg extensions going, putting a little bit of blood in those quads, man, ready for the arrival of the king. As soon as Ron gets here, man, it's game time. We're about to crush some quads. All right, guys, so it's just about to go. 
We're already war warming up. You can see the sweat on my face, man. We're already warming up with some leg extensions. And uh, some of our brothers just arrived. What's up, Derek? There he is. As you can tell, I came here to train uh, calves. Just all calves. Oh, shit. Like 400 sets of calves. Those are those the are those the stars and stripes, actually, man. Actually, are those the hot, America pants? Do they have hot yoga here. <laughs> they have hot, hot yoga starts at midnight, right? <laughs> that's what I really came to do. That's what you dress for. And big Ron's here as well, man. Ronnie wearing the tights too. Yeah, buddy. You ain't got the America tights Ronnie, on though, man. Ronnie started the tight revolution back in the nineties. Ronnie's wearing them red, them red right? tights, oh. man. Oh, I got extra. See, oh, you see, got one for me. See my bonus, man. Check my bonus out. Look at that. Look at that. I must have been working. That's worth like that's worth like an American dime right yeah. now. Yeah. <laughs> All right, man. So it's just Take about to go 11:30. We're just about to uh, get real busy with some quads. What's up, guys? All right. So we just made it to the end of the quad workout. And just so you know, I'm not messing with you. That is indeed. 20 to 2 in the a.m. <laughs> so by the time we got started, man, it was about uh, it was about 11:30 in the p.m. and we've been training for over two hours now. And uh, let me let me give you guys a little example on work ethic right here. My man Ronnie Coleman still going at it, still finishing off with some hamstrings, swole bait, hitting his final set. Derek Sioka. Are you done, Derek? Or are you still going? We're never done, man. We're never done. <laughs> I think he's probably got one more set left as well, man. But we're pretty much done here. It's been a, uh, an Asher as well. How could I forget Asher in the background? Still with us, too. So no one's tapped out yet. <laughs> but we're almost done here, man. So we're going to, uh, we should be out of here by about 2 in the a.m. And then we've got to find somewhere to eat. We've got to find somewhere to get some post workout games. To feed that post leg workout growth. I don't know where the fuck we're gonna find somewhere to eat at 2 and a.m. But I hope someone's got some better ideas with me, man. We'll see you guys with those post workout gains somewhere. What's up, guys? We found somewhere to eat at 3:30 in the a.m. Where are we at, Asha? Pancake kitchen. What are you eating, Asha? <laughs> Pancakes, time <laughs> soon. <laughs> of course. And man. ice cream. Pancakes and, and breakfast. ice cream. Breakfast, post workout, <laughs> everything. What do you got down there, Derek? We got uh, a steak, no sauce, yeah. and some grilled potatoes, no oil. Someone's prepping for a show. Mm -hmm. Fairly clean post workout meal. Yeah, sure, mm -hmm. man. Ron, what you got there, man? Thank you. <laughs> Ronnie's trying to put some size on <laughs> We got Norm as well man Josh and Lenny still with us I'm eating uh, I got like some Some grilled chicken and potatoes I was actually impressed I thought Pancake Kicks would only be serving pancakes mm -hmm. By the name But um, we got all kinds of stuff going on So They got a steak us. on a pancake I know Crazy steak pancake Pancake steak. steak That's yeah. what you got there Norman yeah. Pancake and steak Crazy. So if you ever find yourself in Adelaide at 3.30 in the morning <laughs> looking for somewhere to go eat, Pancake Kitchen's where it's at. All right, we're going to get this food down, man, and we will, uh, I will check back in with you guys for the last installment of this here, episode eight, on my way home. Okay, guys, so just rolling on in back home, man. Just uh, finished dinner with, with the fellas, finished that there post-workout meal. I called it dinner. Probably should have called it breakfast. Let's just call it post-workout meal at the uh, the Pancake Kitchen with uh, Ronnie Coleman, Derek Sioka from Ronnie Coleman Signature Series, man. So finished that up and uh, and just rolled on in home right now and check it. Just so you guys know that I'm uh, keeping it 100 with you. It's, uh, what is that? 20 past four? 20 past four in the AM. So we spent about an hour um, having post-workout meal, man, get some post-workout games, talking a little bit of business and, you know, doing the sort of things that you do at, I don't know, three o'clock on the, in the morning on a Friday morning after training legs at midnight, man. But, uh, but it's all good. It's good fun. It's good times. Um, those guys, man, they're great guys. Ronnie Coleman is, is, is a fantastic guy. 
Derek Sioka is, is a fantastic guy, man. Good friends of mine in the industry. And, and, and we just love chilling. And we don't get to chill very often. We don't get to train very often. We don't get to meet up in person very often. So when they're on this side of the world or when uh, myself and, and, and Nee Bosch are on that side of the world, man, that's just how we roll. That's just, that's just what happens. But it's good times, man. It's good times. I'm happy that we found the pancake uh, kitchen open late as well to allow us to uh to get those post-workout gains man or else uh, they might have been back here at casa del joe and me in the kitchen cooking for them <laughs> or something like that but it's all good so guys that's a wrap that is a wrap episode eight this is the last episode of this first ever inaugural arnold classic 2015 vlog man this is this uh, clip is the last installment of the episode eight so that is a complete wrap for this video series guys look i i hope you've enjoyed it i hope it's been insightful i hope it's been informative i hope it's been entertaining as always that's how we try and keep it on the messengers youtube channel and uh and i hope you guys have enjoyed watching it so uh, you know it's been something an idea that we came up with and, and just decided to do it pretty much at the drop of a hat. And, uh, and so I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have enjoyed it, or even if you haven't enjoyed it, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, man. Stay up to date with all the latest editions of everything on the YouTube channel. All the new video series, the old video series, your favorite video series, and some new, new, undiscovered novel video series that we've got coming up man i won't tell you what they are but if you subscribe you'll be the first to know about them and while you're subscribing man while you're waiting for those new video series and enjoying all the old ones guys don't forget stay massive